Welcome, this is the energy vibration um, reading for the Aquarian Sun, Moon, and Rising Sun for the third week of uh, um, May. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Please like, share these videos, and I'm sorry for the break. I'm back now. All right, you Aquarians, let's see what's happening. Please remember to cross watch, cross watch, watch coming up in this week for the Aquarians. You're all in your head, the Three of Swords has to do with the Knight of Cups. So some of you are dealing with someone between the ages of 18 and 45. There is some heartbreaks with this person. Five of uh, Wands conflicts is uh, in the reverse. Now, the two, there is definitely some of you could be receiving an offer okay so that is uh, the energy that some of you could be having there could be doors of opportunities that is about to open for you guys so open up to the energies okay so as we look in this week we have um, heartbreaks feelings of heartbreaks whatever is transpiring there is a lot going on with you guys feelings of heartbreaks and it has to do with someone who is dealing with a Pisces cancer or scorpion between the ages of 18 and 45 there is the page of swords there is communication that is coming at you or coming about this person something you're going to be finding out some of you are really dealing with a water sign men or women in this month we have also um, the man where there could be communication from a Pisces cancer or a scorpion okay the six of coins is in the reverse for whatever reason um, some of you um, could be helping out a situation whatever the situation is um, the six of coins is in reverse as we also look in the weekend we have the energy of um, a, a good positive energy because uh, um, the page of ones there is something to do with information about money so some of you will receive this message some of you won't receive this message some of you could be dealing with a young Pisces um, Pisces cancer or scorpion and it could be a situation where you're going to be receiving information that either this person abuse your information or is taking your money whatever it is but there is going to be help coming okay and uh, um, definitely you're going to be receiving this message but help is going to be coming and some of you your financial stability is going to be good because someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion or older person could be a father figure that is going to be coming in to bring you and what this is basically saying it could be this person passed away and this money is there what you're not aware of that that's what I'm receiving for someone out there so if uh, you have someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion who has passed away there is some money out there that you're not aware of okay it can be um, a masculine or feminine okay this energy fell out there is going to be definitely success coming up definitely success coming up some of you are going to be receiving help there's definitely success coming up as you notice it is an opening that is going to be open up for you there is definitely an opening something some unexpected opening is going to be happening for some of you okay unexpectedly let's look what is happening the three of swords what is the energy with this three of swords there is going to be information this person someone could be bringing some of you some heartbreak information it could be um a young person but this information it could be a child you could be heartbroken over a situation with a child um, it could be that a child is coming at you with an you know a horrible situation or they're speaking to you very harshly so expect that it could be happening in the week and it's all about money okay so it's as if your child is like yeah and I need money and this and that and and, and you're so heartbroken because it's as if um, this child only see you as a, 
a money pump or it could be that um you're heartbroken because you found out that this child as you know in whatever way as access your information and try to get uh, your financial stability and that sort of a thing so be aware of this and whatever is happening but there is definitely there's going to be some heartbreaks because someone is coming at you and it's all about uh, money that is what i'm receiving but you're going to be happy um whatever the heartbreak is whatever the situation that is affecting you you're going to be um coming out on top now some of you are dealing with the king of the the, the knight of cups so some of you um this could be a child it could be your partner it could be that you found out that this person is having communication with um someone who is in Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius. No, however way the spell out, it could be that is the godmother or the child, stepmother or whoever. But whoever this Knight of Cups is, someone or there is an adult that is an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius is not really happy with this person, and it's as if she is saying, you know, what have you done? She's not really happy happy with this person. It's as if she found out something that he has done. And what has transpired is that these two people have used this young person in such a way that has caused so much conflicts and chaos in the life of others. And you're going to be stepping back. You're going to be stepping back. And the energy of the father and mother is in. And it could be if your father or mother is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarius and you are dealing, it could be a partner, it could be a brother, it could be a sister, this, um, whoever this um, um, water sign person is, definitely it has to do with a child. And these two people have this person under control. And as if, you know, they are reigning over this person and you are stepping back and said, I, I don't want to be a part of this. The page of swords, so a lot of message is going to be coming in. There's information that is going to be coming in that you definitely have to make a, uh, a decision about this child or whoever the person is because information is going to be coming in and it has to do, again, financial stability. Again, it has to do with financial stability. Whatever the situation is or was, it has to do with financial stability. And in this week for you guys, it's all about financial stability. But there is definitely luck that is going to be coming out. And there's definitely an offer that is going to be coming in. Whatever the situation is, there's going to be a resolution. The King of Cups is here. And um, some of you could be having a brand new start with this King of Cups. It's as if someone who is a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion is definitely going to give you a brand new start. Whoever this person is, they are going to be opening up themselves and saying, hey, you have done such good work or such good situation. And they are going to be giving you like a heads up, a start, or they are going to see your potential and going to push you forward. The energy of the six of coin is here. Let's look and see what energy it has to do with deception. It was as if you were supposed to get some help, but some deceitful situation where someone has done something deceptive, which we're going to be looking in. You're not worried about this. You're thinking, okay, let it go. Whatever the situation is, okay, let it go. You know, I'm not going to fight over the situation, whatever must be, let it be. And you're just going to, you know, ask the universe to take whatever is happening to you. And, you know, it's going to resolve itself. But definitely an offer or some help was supposed to come in. But there was a deceptive move that was made. And whoever has tried to make the deceptive move, we, let, 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 let's look at that. Let's look at that. You know, you guys, if you listen to my reading, I'm always trying to find out what exactly has taken place and transpired. So let's see. What is this? Dece yeah, the deceptive move is over and there is going to be a new strong so um stability six of wands is here also where there is going to be some news coming in the page of swords is in reverse and this is 
like um, a young person, whoever this young person was, is between the ages of 18 and 45. Whoever this person is, you guys are going to, it could be yourself because this is an air sign person. Um, and this person is between the ages of 18 and 45. Let's look and see what is going to be happening. The organization, our organization is going to be coming down on you, okay? Um, some of you, um, an organization is going to come down on you because you're in the reverse. And that means that you as an Aquarian has done something and an organization is working to resolve a situation, something that you have done that was not, um, right. And our organization is trying to work to resolve a situation. Okay. Oh, wonderful news. Some of you are definitely going to be receiving the energies that money is coming in and your financial stability is going to be in balance. This is a very, very beautiful reading. And you have also the Ace of Pentacles. So you have uh, um, the Page of Pentacles message coming in about your financial st stability. And you also have the Ace of Pentacles. So whatever that has um, transpired whatever situation that has transpired what we're seeing here is that there is definitely going to be resolution to situations that is going to be coming up and this is going to be good ladies and gentlemen please 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 cross watch cross watch to find out what else is coming up um, what is there for you? So we're going to be asking the beauty coin. What messages do you have for the Aquarians for this third week of uh, May? And drink a lot of water. This can also, this is like really drink a lot of water, you Aquarians. Whatever is happening, someone, someone out there needs to drink a lot of water, okay? Archangel Michael, what do you have as message for the Aquarian in the third week? It's going to be beautiful for some of you who have been really positive, really going through positive, wonderful things. It's just going to be very, very beautiful. Archangel Michael, love, romance, angels are going to be helping you, okay? So whatever the situation is, whatever is transpiring, the Roman romance angels from Archangel Michael come up and it says, they're guiding angels of my soulmate. Thank you for preparing my soulmate and me for... Um, love for giving us the motivation to make the beautiful life changes and for arranging for us to meet. Thank you for helping us recognize in each other and to have the courage to say hello so that we can eventually devote our time in a wonderful, unique relationship. Okay, so this is beautiful ladies and gentlemen archangel michael bring you a, a positive wonderful message so um i want to say to each and every person um please go and check out the other readings um check out to see for your your parents and all of that i want to say to you namaste until next time